All right, in the previous episode, we made it to the church. And let's just say it, 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 that I, I ain't want to go back. All right. But anyways, after spending some time in the closet like R. Kelly, we watched somebody get folded and we heard another person get folded and then we ended up you know trekking through the forest we were supposed to get chased but you know me i'm a sneak demon so ain't nobody see me but we ended up at this little mill house this water thing and i don't know where the fluff to go so we're gonna start off with me figuring out where the fluff to go Hi guys it's ed fire gaming here and if like me you've been playing outlast 2 you may well have got stuck on the mill segment of the game it's just after the chapel following being chased as you can see i've got the door behind me when you get to the mill all you need to do is one really simple thing find a crank and use the crank that's two things anyway you may well have got to here you go up the stairs at the back of the building you notice it tells you you need a crank if you've not found the crank yet it's really simple go back inside head to the door to the right the crank is hidden neatly in there I got past this point, I actually went back up and put the crank in and cranked three times and wondered what on earth it had done. So you'll see me going upstairs here, putting the crank in, you'll need to crank it three times, I've edited it so I've only cranked once, and then you need to run back down into the building. What you'll notice is that when you get back into the main building, someone spawns very quickly. You want to run in, duck down, and go to the right, because that big cog that was moving around is what you stopped by using the crank. Simple, right? Anyway, hopefully that's helped you get past the mill area of the game. If you fancy watching a playthrough with some silly commentary, I've done it. The playlist is here. And if this video is useful, please give me a like. What the? I knew it had something to do with that. I knew it. Oh, shit. Ah! Oh shit, he goes under? Or... <sighs> Holy fuck, where'd you go? The road to the mine is somewhere around here. Where the fluff are we going, bro? Oh no. Not that big. Alright, I'm assuming we have to go that way because she's guarding it. Right. Oh my goodness. Jesus, don't you ever quit? I know, right? He sees me here. I got a head start. Mike, there's got to be a way through.
That bitch gonna pop out somewhere, bro. I couldn't see if it saved. Anyways. What should I talk? Oh, I was thinking about earlier. I was like, bro. These be <laughs> scared to come in, bro. You know what I'm saying? Some of y'all be watching this. I've been terrified, so I haven't been, like, talking much this episode. But y'all need to drop some comments. I feel like, uh, can you imagine? This is the analogy I'm going to use. This is going to make y'all feel bad. Can you imagine going to a... I don't want to be out here. Let's go right back. But could you imagine? Jesus. I should have prayed for the situation. Can you imagine going to a restaurant, right? And the server is asking you shit. You know, she's asking you for your order, this, that, and the third. Or whatever. And she's serving you and you just don't say nothing. You just kind of look at her and give her, like, the I appreciate it thing. You feel me? Oh, not this shit again. I'm gonna get jump scared. Oh god, saving? I don't even know what I need that for. All right, it's saved. Look at that, my voice is cracking. Cause I'm terrified, what the fuck? Okay, you jump through. Oh no. All right, that's what I'm in because I forgot that I did record for 30 minutes last night. Um, bro, <laughs> this part is actually kind of scary. Not gonna lie to you, this part is actually kind of creepy. Not, nah, you know what I'm saying? But, hey, all right. So I, sw oh my gosh, <laughs> that's bad. All right, so I like switch screens to like make my face cam bigger. This, that, and that third. And I forgot to add the microphone to this. Y'all don't know nothing about that. Long story short, my mic cut out. So basically, what I'm gonna do here is about eight ish minutes so instead of making this his own little episode little mini sode what i'm gonna do is i'm just gonna record some more outlets tonight and then i'll throw this in to it so yeah we'll just yeah we'll just get to the next part of the episode all right yes sir we're back bro i've been thinking about it all day what i'm gonna do when i get back on this game thinking about what I'm gonna talk about everything bro all right I know we had to jump through here oh my gosh at this point it's GG's bro put that away we don't care about it no more what here's one thing right why are we all of a sudden captain save a hoe like why do we need to go warn her that she's finna get bodied like <clears throat> At this point, it should be GG's worry about yourself. Of course the fucking door is locked. You know what I'm saying? And then she's over here whispering, do you hate him and shit? Like, no. Like, leave me alone, woman. Ooh, I'll take that battery, though. I don't... I don't get it. I... I'm honestly lost. I, I don't... Bro, what? I ain't gonna lie. I ain't gonna lie. I'm finna look it up. I ain't gonna... Bro, what the fuck? What the fuck? Yeah, I'm finna look it up. I hate this fucking game. <laughs> I hate this game. I hate this game. All right, boys, we're in for a fuck fest. Let's get it. I hate this fucking game, bro. This. Nah, save my spray, bro. Bro, this is some God of War level puzzles, bro. This is some old, some old bullshit, bro. Like, why? Anyways. 
I don't forgot what I was talking about. Oh, hell no. Bitch was just banging on the gate a second ago. I know she's gonna pop out the woodworks. And she gonna mean business too. Sorry. Oh, hell no. Uh-uh. Mm-hmm. I put my sketchers on, bitch. You ain't catching me. Hell no. Oh my god, the gate's fucking fucking fuck 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 fuck. Oh no. Oh no. It might be GG's, bro. Blake? Blake? Oh. Hmm. Alright, we bust a bust a left, right? Yep. Just keep busting left. If you hear something, haul ass. You got your sneakers on. You're good. Just stay composed. Don't even worry about it. Can't nobody touch you. You're the chosen one. You're the fucking chosen one. Oh shit. Oh shit. Dip. Oh, she opened the fucking door. No, fuck that bitch. Fuck that bitch. Fuck that bitch. Run, nigga. Why are you wasting time? Yep. Connect. Bob the Builder. Holy fuck, you're fucking me. Oh, pull it, nigga! Run, bitch! Get your ass in there! Oh, she grabbed me! Kick her in the teeth! Kick her in the teeth! She's fast as fuck! Yeah, eat your weedies, ho! Eat your weedies, ho! Get kicked in your motherfucking eye! You thought it was... I just... I just... What? I just Ray Rice still shit earlier. What are you... Come on! Fuck. Keep moving. I... I honestly hate that bitch. I am honestly sweaty. I, I hate that. She is a whore. I know you're not supposed to say that about, you know, a lady, but she is a whore. She is a six foot two whore. Fuck that bitch. She needs a bath. Oh my goodness. She is dusty. Her hair is clamping together. Oh, here. Enough. What is that? Oh, okay. Go for it. <laughs> oh, I'll just fucking mute it. Where's <laughs> the mine? Where the, the mine? Heretics are. The mine? Speaking of which. Why are we being Captain Save her? her? At this point, at this point, look, let me let me talk to y'all. At this point, let's say you're you're in a plane crash, boom, plane goes down like this. You're in this scenario. At this point, fuck that bitch. Alright? I know she's your your wife, your girlfriend, whatever. But at this point, it's GG's. If she gets abducted by people, you just walk through a like a, a a slaughterhouse and just got chased by a six foot two witch bitch. Like it's GG's for her. You know what I'm saying? My old coach used to say, like like girls are like lampposts. If you keep walking, there's another one. There is no there is no need for this interaction here. There's no need for us to be Captain Savaho in the mountains getting chased by these motherfuckers. I, I don't get it. I don't get it. This type of heroism hero. hero you know what I'm saying? I left my, my dictionary. Ah. What? So, talk to me, Blake. What is, like, the plan? Because you said you're going to the mines. You didn't say what you were going to do when you got to the mines. That's my problem. I think you're acting out of impulse here. And impulse decisions normally don't end well. Just saying. Speaking from personal experience here. You know, just running in there with your Captain America thong going isn't going to work. And, of course, the fucking door doesn't work. You know, for some motherfuckers who have torture devices in the church, you'd think their their front door would open, right? You just did like a fucking pull up earlier. You can't hurdle a three foot. A nice transition. Wake up. Wake up. Yep. I'm still here. See, he knows it's a hallucination at this point. See, at this point, I know it's a hallucination. We speed running this shit. We walking through. We ain't scared of no dark. This shit ain't real. What are you talking about? <laughs> you that shit not scary. That shit not scary. Where you at, little bitch? Where you at? Yep. I'm all up in your classrooms. What you gonna do? Pop out the dark, give me a little scare. It's alright. Ain't nothing new. 
hell, I think it's good for the heart. You need a little bit of adrenaline in it, you know what I'm saying? A little thrill seeker. Oh, movie night? The Hangman game. Like Lynn and Jess used to play. The Hangman game, I don't... This must be somewhere. Jessica would have left the Hangman somewhere. For Lynn to find it. Jessica would have left a hangman for Lynn the Font. What? You know what? That that's something I wanted to talk about. This story went from zero to sixty real quick. Like at one point, we're just chilling, going on the trip, and then out of nowhere, the plane crashes. Okay, plane crash. You know, find some cell service, get up out of here. Then your wife gets abducted by some witch people. So it's like this took off quickly. At first, we was just chilling, running through the six with our woes. You know. And now we're in a school looking for a ghost bitch leaving Hangman. And I didn't even know Hangman was like an action figure. I thought that was just a game you play on a smartphone or something. I'm not fucking with these sound effects. You can play all the spooky music in the world. I don't care. But when you start throwing in little sound cues and shit, I don't like that. I don't mess with that at all. You need the transparency. You know, why is there water noises? If you hear water noises in a horror movie, it's not water. That's 100% blood. But we ain't scared of nothing. Because we're Blake. We're fucking... We're fucking high school All-American out here. We stare deaf in the face and laugh. Bro, you can whisper sweet enough things in my ear all you want. I don't care. I've heard everything in the book. And I got your little transparency sheet. I'm on top of the world. Yep. I wish a little bitch would. I'm gonna need you to keep that, uh, see it gets quiet. I hate that shit. Watch. The beat gonna drop as I'm getting, getting murdered. Just casually murdered. You know what? Ain't nothing scary if you just talk through it. Yeah, there we go. Just keep it talking. You know what I'm saying? I would close the door, but ghosts don't give a fuck about a door. You know what I'm saying? So we just gonna keep it pushing and keep it talking. They can't hurt you unless you unless you let them. You know what I'm saying? And I told that little bitch that I uh, I solved her puzzle. Yep. Looky there. What the? F I'm not gonna solve it. I don't know that hoe. Unforgivable. Oof! What did you do? Sounds about right. What did he do? Oh, he got some some EDP shit in his past, huh? He got some he got some shit in his past, huh? I would have never thought unforgivable. You finna get jump scared out the ass. This finna be tragedy. I ain't finna be scared. That's on you. That's tough. So w what do we do now? Like we solved the puzzle. How the fuck do I get out of here? Find a way out. I was asking myself the same question, Blake. I'm at we're in a hallucination, but it's taking my real batteries to get out. You feel me? Hold on, is the door open? Let's go. We getting out of here. Happy ending. Uh, that That's exactly what we wanted. That's exactly what we wanted. Out here chilling. Can I get my battery back, though? What time is it? It's one. Oh, another thing I wanted to talk about is, bro, he been here for a fat minute. Is there no day cycle out here? Is this going down in Alaska or something? Cause I know. Oh my goodness. I think like in a, there's some place in the world where uh, there's like a certain time of the year where they just don't have daytime, and then there should be an inverse somewhere. Bro, I know this nigga got fired, bro. He had. <laughs> I can open the fuck. I hate this bitch. 
I, I would have loved for like a button to prop up before I spent eight minutes walking in a fucking circle. That would have been very nice. Burning my batteries. You know what? Where is this little bitch? I'm not even scared no more. This bitch owes me a fucking uh You can laugh all you want, bitch. You owe me some batteries. No, you little hoe. I'm not turning around. Fuck that shit. You finna have to jump scare me from behind. I'm not stupid. Fuck that bitch. Nah. Hey. Bitch. Fuck that shit. What the fuck? Anyways, hold on. Um... You owe me some batteries, motherfucker. Because I just wasted two whole batteries looking for your bitch ass, and all you doing is distorting my screen. I'm not falling for that. You're not slick. You're all illusions. You can't touch me. Because if you do, you're going to get folded. Of course, it's locked. <laughs> oh, you bitch ass motherfucker. You, you fucking hoe. That shit wasn't even that bad. Oh, okay. You gave me a little chill. Ooh, that was so spooky. You ain't even hurt me. You just threw me down the hallway. Oh, shit. This nigga actually hurt. Bro, you ain't even tear none of your clothes, bro. You're good. I've seen protagonists get their shit fucked up and be chilling, bro. It's all right. Pop you a little, pop you a little pill. You know, a little tall and all. Bandage up. Yeah, band bandage up real quick and be chilling. All right, I feel like that has some significance. What significance does it have? I have no idea. All right, that's definitely where that little fucker came from. I knew that. I knew I knew that. I did, Look, I'm going to play the replay of me saying I'm not turning around this, that, and the third because I know what you're trying to do. I'm not turning around. Fuck that shit. You finna have to jump scare me from behind. I'm not stupid. Fuck that bitch. Nah. And then I turned around and let them do it. Folded. Of course it's locked. <laughs> oh, you bitch ass motherfucker. I felt like that was irreversible. So we're just gonna be stuck in this loop of hallway? You are stupid motherfucker, you know that? You are stupid motherfucker. Push the fucking desk. Yes, jump on it. Get in the, you stupid motherfucker. Get in the vent, nigga. W, look, I knew there had some significance. I'm getting, here. I'm getting used to it. What the fuck? Oh, it's a time loop. I was just here. Exactly, I see, I'm glad you understand. That means you know it's gonna be. Get your Ew. Yo, what kind of tentacle? What? How many batteries we got? One? Cross the bridge. All right, let's cross the bridge. Then it's nap time. That this some old. First, I get chased by that little six foot two. Ho that bridge? We we need to cross that bridge. You know what? I forgot we were pairing this up with the, the little mini so that I recorded earlier. Yeah, um Yeah. That bridge gonna have to wait till tomorrow. Anyways, hopefully I can get this out to y'all anytime soon. This is some old bullshit. This is some old bullshit, but it's okay. Right. Scared. You know, they got me with the jump scare. That was cool, but I saw it coming. I'm reading these games like a book. Dr. Seuss out here. Anyways, <clears throat> that's going to do it for this one, though. Uh, I ain't really got much to say. I said everything I need to say in there. I got my my, my cuss words out because th these kind of games right here, man, these games right here be like, you know what I'm saying? I can't think of a word for it, but my like, um... Let's just say my good boy nature. It makes my good boy nature, the, the, the politeness, just go square out the window when you're getting chased by somebody trying to kill you. But for the third time, that's going to do it for this one. And remember, Envy No Man, because we know we up next. Sponsored by Atari. And... Hey, <laughs>